Good day everyone, I'm Zach from Olive Electronic Technology Company. So today, I will do an unboxing video of our oxygen concentrators. So, when actually receive as a customer, as a distributor, when you receive your, your carton of oxygen concentrators, firstly, you can just take a look at the exterior. Okay, There's actually a voltage and a model number stated outside of the carton box. So in this case, this machine is actually a 220 volt and the model number is OLV10, which is our 10 liter model of oxygen concentrators. So, when you unbox it, at the first glance, you will see all the accessories that you've got to get. These are, keep in mind that, these are all your extra sets of uh, accessories. Because the previous, you have your present one already installed in your machine. So what we will get is one, uh, one unit of humidifier bottle. You make sure that it's actually, uh, there's no defect, there's no damage. You take it out. You also receive two extra sets of nasal cannulas. And this is for your use. Of course, if you need more of these accessories for your personal use or for your resale, you can just contact us for more information. We can order extra accessories together with your uh, units as well. You also get one set of extra HEPA filter, which is our high efficiency filter as well. Okay, this is all the extra sets. You also get one piece of first filter together with your user manual and one warranty card. These are all the basic accessories that you're going to get. So let's put it back the accessories and take out the accessories panel. So right, ne right now next, you will see our machine actually laying out in the panel box. Remove the blaster bag. Okay. And then you can just remove the machine. So, so please check, is there any visual, visual defects around the machine? You will see your power plug, which is safely attached. Your oxygen tubes is connected to your output of your oxygen flow. And no visible, visible defects. And next, turn over the machine. You will see a strap at the bottom. So this black strap is to hold our air compressor inside the oxygen concentrators during transportation. This, you need to loosen it. Okay. Using it like this, okay. Then you can just put it back on. Uh, if you if you find that inhaling the oxygen directly from uh, the machine will be dry, you can just put some water. We suggest distilled water inside our humidifier bottle. So when you open it, you can just pour this a minimum and maximum mark. So please remember to place water level in between these two markings. So for example, like this. You can just put it here, okay? Then you can connect the oxygen tube from here to the top. Next, you can then connect nasal cannula to the output of your humidifier bottle. After all this is done, please check that the machine is working. You turn on the manual switch at the back. After that, proceed to turn on from here. So the oxygen concentrator will start working. And then you can just place the laser cannulas to your nose. Then you can proceed to adjust the flow, your preferred flow rate. This is a 10 liter machine, so the flow rate is from one, from zero liter to 10 liter per minute. Okay, so for example, if I prefer to have six liter per minute, uh, I can adjust the knob to 6 liter. You can actually proceed to see there's 4 buttons on the LCD screen. The first button is on off button which I just pressed earlier. The second button and the third button is a timing off and timing plus function. So when you actually press timing plus, this is a 10 minute per press timer. So for example, if, you want, if I want to, before going to sleep, so for example, I need to set it for around 1 hour, 16 minutes. I can keep pressing it to 16 minutes. So the machine will automatically turn off after 16 minutes. This is a very useful option. And for the fourth option, fourth button is actually a voice, voice function. You can press, toggle it between the audio functions to be on or off. So right now, I'll just turn off it. 
this, this is basically how uh, oxygen concentrators basically work. Next, I will show you guys how to test the oxygen purity at uh, whatever, whatever flow rate you wish. So for example, this is our OLV10, a 10 liter oxygen concentrator. So we can test whether this machine is able to reach 93% plus or minus 3% even at its highest flow. So let me first start by measuring our ambient atmosphere, what's the oxygen priority. You can just take a look, let's just on it. Okay, you can see right now, the oxygen priority is at around 21%. So let's watch uh, what will happen after this analyzer is actually connected to our oxygen, uh, oxygen concentrator. We'll allow this machine to run for two minutes. So right now, and make sure that to, uh, in order to test it at the highest level, we'll switch our, pure, our flow rates to the maximum, to 10 liter per minute. Okay, right now it's just nice at 10 liters per minute. Then we'll actually connect this and watch the numbers go up. There's actually an LED function here also. So you can just turn on. You'll make you uh, see clearly the numbers at the dark. Okay, you can watch the numbers go up. Because the priority, the oxygen flow Is going through this analyzer machine. Okay, so right now you can see that it actually reaches 93% and remains stable at 93%. Next, we'll cover how to do a simple maintenance of our machine. First, let's remove the plug from the machine. Okay, the machine is turned off, and when you look at the back of a machine, you will see that this can be opened. So, when you actually open this, you will see our filters this is actually our first filter this is the primary the first filter that air uh, that is used to help filter air particles from the air this we suggest that to change this every six months but this is washable this is our first filter when you look inside there's actually another filter this is our HEPA filter our high efficient high efficiency second filter this filter cannot be washed because it's inside the plastic component. So what we suggest once again to change this every three to six months. It depends on how how many hours that you're going to use on this machine. Okay, let's put it back in front. And on top of this, when you are using our oxygen concentrator, please reminder, this is a gentle reminder, to place our oxygen concentrators uh, at least 10 centimeters away from wall so because the input input and, and output of the air is at the back okay this is actually the output let, let me let's put it back okay. this is actually the input output is at the bottom and reminder that please do not place our oxygen concentrators on carpets or soft grounds because it may affect the output of our uh, uh, oxygen concentrators and please, before you use, please read our uh, hazard instructions carefully. Uh, the, the most important thing is to do not place this machine near fire or please do not smoke near this machine. This is actually our general maintenance guide to you. And for more information, please uh, take a look at our user manual. Together, we will be shipped together with our machines.